Wow, what incredible news to wake up to on a Friday morning. Jurgen Klopp is leaving Liverpool at the end of the season. This is a huge blow, probably the worst news for any Liverpool fan out there. Jurgen's been one of the best managers in the world over the last nine years. And this season, Liverpool are going for four trophies. I think he's done an incredible job and it's going to be very difficult to replace him. Of course, they still have the season to play out and, you know, Jurgen Klopp will give it his all and ensure this team that he's rebuilt will win as many trophies as they can. And I believe they will win two trophies at least I think this season. It's a surprise that he's leaving just after he's rebuilt the team unlike other managers you know who've let their teams grow old and then left. Won't name them but you know who I'm talking about. Let's look at who could possibly replace Jurgen Klopp and I'd love to hear who Liverpool fans would like to be their next manager in the comments below. First of course the one that everyone's talking about and who I've made a video on is Xabi Alonso. He's doing an amazing job at Leverkusen. He's not an experienced manager. He's only had a year at the moment at Leverkusen. Before that he was managing reserve teams in Spain but the way his team are playing and obviously his historical links to Liverpool make him one of the prime candidates. The other options I've seen being thrown out there are Roberto De Zerbi who's doing a great job at Brighton and he's working under a structure that is similar to the one that Liverpool have at the moment. One of the big things that obviously has come out alongside Jurgen Klopp leaving today is that his backroom staff are leaving as well. His three lieutenants Linders, Vitor Matos and Peter Kravitz. So a new manager coming in will also need to replace that. And there's no sporting director at Liverpool at the moment. Jorge Schmatke is a temporary sporting director and he's leaving at the end of January. So maybe for De Zerbi to come in, he won't have the same setup as he has at Brighton and it, it would all have to be done by the Liverpool hierarchy. I've seen some other ones out there like Graham Potter, which I don't think will happen. Hansi Flick, I don't think Liverpool will go for him either. FSG probably want a younger manager. Um, Simone Inzaghi is one I haven't seen linked, but if I was Liverpool, I'd be looking at what Simone Inzaghi has done at Inter. He's a young manager. He's been really successful there and he's been operating under a stricter budget there as well at Inter compared to let's say what Napoli and Milan and Juventus have had in recent times. I think he's a really good manager potentially one that Liverpool could look at. Then you're looking left field really. Steven Gerrard. I mean I don't think he's a manager. I think he's retired. You know he's in Saudi Arabia. Shouldn't even be considered. Uh, then there's ones like Zinedine Zidane but everyone I think knows that Zidane is way for the French national team job and finally here's one that I'm just throwing out there pure left field Gary O'Neill and I'm saying this because Gary O'Neill is one of those coaches in the Premier League who learnt what he knows at Liverpool he's actually a Liverpool coach you know just like uh, Steve Cooper was as well so there's potentially someone who might be you know out there that's a crazy thought but maybe Liverpool will go for him anyway those are my thoughts on this I'm very sad to see Jurgen Klopp leave the Premier League he's been the only manager who's gone toe-to-toe -to -toe with Pep Guardiola since Pep has arrived well, City and their 115 charges as well, of course. And it's sad that feels he doesn't have the energy anymore for the job. But I can understand that as well. Coaching, managing a football team is really difficult. For him to have done it for nine years with the pressure being at a top club is immense. And I wish Jurgen Klopp all the best. Thank you all for watching. And if you do like my videos, please subscribe. Helps me grow my channel. And as always, I'll see you on the next video.